Hello, my lovelies. Mary Meet, and welcome to the fir my first chan my first channel, my first video on my second channel. It's the first of many videos to come. Okay. My first question is my question. This this question is directed towards me. Well, let me explain something real quick. First, real quick. Wicca is an earth-based religion. And it, like I said, is an earth based religion, and there's several other religions that come into Wicca as well. They're a part of Wicca, <coughs> excuse me, I don't want to say that they're, um, like sub genres or sub categories or sub religions to. Wicca itself, but um, Wicca, to me, Wicca encompasses all the other thought paths that you could possibly go on within Wicca itself. Um, oh, the best way to explain that is explain this is that Wicca itself branches off into many different other Wiccan religions. Um, there's um, Gardenian Wicca, which I forget. The man who created that religion was, I think, was back in the 50s. I, 50s or 60s, I think, but I'm not for sure. If anybody who follows that, who goes along in that religion, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm telling you I'm not real for sure if it was like the 50s or the 60s, but I think it was the Somewhere between the late 50s, early 60s, but I'm not for sure, though. Or maybe even in the 70s. I'm not for sure. I think it's in the 50s, but I'm not for sure on that. It's been a while since I read about it. I might have to refresh my memory on that. And there's, um, Dianic. I think that's how you pronounce it. Dianic Wicca, which is... It, that one focuses on the female, the uh, the female, the goddess aspect of Wicca. Wicca is dual. It's um, Wicca focuses both on the goddess and the god, both female and male aspects of the god and the goddess. You can't really Dianic Wicca does it, but to me you can't really s segregate or separate the two from the one from another it's both um that's how i see it but that's just me that's how i see it as um and of course there's the tunic tunic i'm just going to call it the norse norse wicca which is easier for me to say which that one is the um the Germanic speaking, the Germanic language groups, like, you know, Danish. Um, I know Dutch was in there. English, German, you know, Scandinavian speaking groups. Um, like, you know, Finland, Norway, Denmark, all those other countries. Germany, Dutch, you know, like I said. Which, Norse, it's, of course, like, you know, the Norse gods and goddesses. It's like, you know, Loki and... You know, the Valkyries, Odin, all that. Yeah, I have that in me, so I pull from that tiny bit. Shh, don't tell Odin. No, I'm joking. I'm, I'm kidding. Don't tell. What the freakers? I hate you, you stupid iPod. I do not hate you. You are mean. You take my music away. You mean, mean iPod. No, I'm kidding. Just don't. I'm rambling. I had to throw that. It's like, you mean. No. I go back. <laughs> Silly iPod. It's just my iPod right now. I'm sorry. I'm rambling. I'm having technical difficulties with the music. Excuse me. Yay! We're back. Stop and twerk. I dislike you. Stop being an idiot. Thank you. 
Okay, people don't mind me. I'm being goofy. Okay, where was I? Norse tradition. Norse. Vikings. Pillage, plunder. No, I'm joking. We do not pillage and plunder. Dude, look at me that way. I did not do it. I know, I'm getting off track here, but um, I have to inject some humor in here. <laughs> yeah, I'm a humorous little witch. Well, not so little, but I'm fluffy. I'm lovable. I'm not fat. I'm fluffy, bitches. That's what I say. I'm not fat. I'm fluffy. Okay, done with that. Okay. Then there's a third, sorry, I'm rambling here. I'm kind of nervous, so bear with me. Um, okay, I'll continue on here. Um, the reason why I myself become became a oh, Wiccan is because I'll just combine the two questions that I have. Um, why I became and what drew me to Wicca and why I became a Wiccan, it, with Wicca, I feel you can pull from different aspects of the religion itself. Like, say, if you want to pull from Dianic and Gardanian and Norse Wicca and combine it, you can. Or if you want to go into, like, you know, the Celt Celtic Wicca or, or Green Witchcraft and, and Fairy wicca you can pull it all together pull pull from it and just mash it together and make it your own it's pretty much like um scratch and sniff on 10390x i i yeah it's the best way i can explain it that's if you get 10390x where you live yeah it's a dayton thing it's an ohio thing i'll just put it that way it's it's a dayton thing 10390x Scratch and sniff. It's a Dayton thing. You have to be a Daytonian. You have to live in Dayton, Ohio. Just to understand I'm joking. You don't have to. Unless you have the iHeartRadio app. I know I'm veering off course. There, like I said, is like you could pull from Celta, Celtic Wicca, Norse Wicca, Fairy Wicca, or whatever, Green Wicca, and combined it. Or you could just like, you know, our Egyptian. Well, that's part of Wicca. It's like you can pull, for, you you can also um, pick. It's like you can pick and choose your own gods and goddesses that you could like um, worship. I guess. Yeah, that's what I do. Um, I pulled in a little Norse Wicca, Norse tradition into my craft. Um. That's the reason why I like Wicca so much. It's like you don't have to conform to any set thing. You only have pretty much basically two, pretty much like, I don't want to call them rules or laws. Pretty much they are, I don't want to call them, I, I'll just, I'll call them laws. Uh, it's. Isn't the, no, it's not bad. I don't want to say that it, they're only got two laws, you know, harm none and do what you will and threefold law. It's just don't pull no bullshit hex on somebody and try to hurt them. Don't hurt nobody. So I'm going to smoke in this. Sorry. you do it. I'm joking. Um, you don't have to conform in Wicca. I don't feel like you have to, but um, you can like mix and match like, you know, gods and goddesses. Just don't piss them off. <laughs> um, it's like I, um, me, I pull from like, you know, the Egyptian gods, you know, Osiris, Horus, or Osiris and his wife Isis and their son Horus and Anubis and Bath. Which I have a statue of. Oh, she's so pretty. P 
okay little cat headed goddess and of course Greek the great gods and goddesses like you know Hera Athena um, Dionysus Zeus and all of them and of course Odin Frisia and everybody else that's the reason why I part of the reason why I became a Wiccan became a Wiccan and what drew me to Wiccan in the first place you can make you can pull little things from pretty much any religion you know you know Judaism um, the one with Buddha I don't know what it's called like Buddhism Buddhism something I don't know don't ask me I don't know I don't know I'm sorry correct me if I'm wrong it's, it's the religion with Buddha eh, Buddha I don't know. what would Buddha do I don't know stuff like that um Buddha 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 no offense don't yell at me don't throw tomatoes at me please I don't like tomatoes tomatoes are yucky you can throw oranges at me I like oranges and caramel apples <coughs> I'm joking but don't throw no fruit at me <coughs> um you can in Christian and all the other religions you can pull from those and like mold m like make your own branch of Wicca what suits you and what you feel is right in your heart that's the reason why I I myself be what drew me to Wicca in the first place and you can yeah whatever suits like what you feel is right in your heart it's like you can pull like you can sit there and call on <laughs> excuse me Hera for something or Athena or Horus or Isis or Frisia or an old Odin and his Valkyries or Loki if you want to play a nasty little trick on somebody. Oh, not a nasty trick, just want to like throw a little trick out there for somebody to, you know, make them laugh. You know, it's like, come on, bitches, laugh for once, you know, light in the mood or something. But that's what drew me to Wicca. But literally, don't do what I just said don't call on Loki because yeah his tricks can go wrong he's a mischievous little shit I don't like him <laughs> Loki he's okay if you like a trickster god I don't I'm not very fond of him after what he did to Fearness I looked his son Fearness the big giant wolf don't mind me I'm being silly but that's me I I I dislike what Loki did to his son the giant wolf fearness but I'll explain that later in another video since this one's getting kind of long so but that's what drew me to Wicca in the first place what why I feel the way I feel about it and to me it feels right and it it feels right in my heart and in my soul so that's just who I am and me that's what I like about it so that's if you have any that's why I feel the way I feel but that's just me if you have any comments or questions just comment let me take this off this is getting a tad annoying my clothes getting a little annoying my hat's getting a little annoying so just leave your comments questions email me um if you need a link to my Facebook or Twitter um or mainly my Facebook check out my first video on this channel leave me a comment question ask me questions comments whatever um, bless uh, I you know have a happy weekend and I will see you later have a merry meet merry part blessed be have a good so on weekend and Halloween weekend, whatever, and blessed be.